What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. I'm excited to announce that this video is sponsored by NordVPN. Whoa. What is NordVPN and why is this important? Okay, this virtual private network creates an encrypted tunnel for your data by hiding your IP address and allows you to use public Wi-Fi and hotspots safely. NordVPN can be streamed from anywhere. You can also use it on up to six different devices, including your smart TV. You can change your virtual location from anywhere, and this is the fastest virtual private network out there. So, if you're like me and you want to stay protected and feel confident everywhere you go, click the link at the top of my description, go to their website, and use the code Micah Morris to get your two year plan plus an additional one month with a huge discount. With all that being said, let's get right back to this video. I'll see you guys on the golf course right now. Welcome back to the channel and welcome to uh, What's in the Bag 2021. I guess that's what I'm gonna call this. Um, I know we're a couple months deep into the year, but I've made a lot of changes to my bag this year. My bag this year compared to my bag last year is absolutely nowhere close to what it was. So I just wanna do a video and uh, show you guys exactly what I'm working with here in 2021. And I don't really have any plans of, of making any drastic changes. Obviously, you know, clubs might have to be just, just tweaked a little bit here and there, but the, the clubs that I have are the clubs that I'm going to stick with for now, I think, okay? I can never promise anything because I don't want to be later in the year and something comes up and then you guys are like, you already switched clubs, switch clubs already. But <laughs> I'm kind of kidding with you guys, but some, sometime I'm not. But here we are. It's a beautiful day. And basically, I'm going to go through the bag, show you guys what I got. And then I'm gonna hit some balls with each one of those clubs and I'm gonna give you a stock yardage that's gonna appear on the screen and stay on the screen throughout the rest of the video once we get to that part. So let's get over to my golf clubs and see, see what I got, see what I'm working with here in uh, 2021. <laughs> All right guys, it may just be a tad windy out here. Um, so hopefully the mic is not doing that little crackling, lacking or whatever it is. But I'm going to start with my putter I'm going to go to my wedges, I'm going to go up through my irons, and then we're going to finish with my three wood and my driver. So, all right guys, so first off for my putter, I have the Odyssey Toulon, and this is the Austin, and I have a stability golf shaft in it, which uh, Jake hooked me up with that not too long ago, and I really love it. So, that is my putter right there, you can see, and I'm really enjoying this one. I'll probably stick with this for a very long time because um, I don't really like switching putters much, to be honest, because... Yes, they do help, but I think more of it's up in the mental game. So that is my putter for right now. All right, so moving on from my putter to my wedges. Um, I am using the Callaway Jaws wedges, and my wedges go from 52 degrees, or it's 51, 56, and 60. And these have the Modus Pro 130 shafts in them. They are X-Flex, and I have just standard golf pride grips. No tape, no extra tape or anything under these, so they're just standard. And those are my wedges, you can see right there. They might be a little bit dirty right now, but, and I also got some cool little, uh, I can't remember what those are called, dead gummit. Ferals. <laughs> I got some cool ferals that Jake threw on there for me. Um, but yeah, those are my wedges. I'm gonna show you all three of them real quick so you can get a little peek. So you can see right here, uh, 60 and this says 52 but it's actually 51 degrees and then 50 60 degree. this is my sand wedge it's pr probably the most used wedge in my bag all right guys so moving on to my irons um, I do I did make a little mistake so I have to correct that real quick I have the Modus Pro 120 X flex in my wedges and my irons. so for my irons I'm hitting the Callaway apex pros the forged my irons go from four iron to pitching wedge and I have three wedges same with my irons I have the standard golf ride grip with no extra tape that's just the way that I like it four iron through pitching wedge with my irons and now we're going to move on to my two iron all right guys moving on to my two iron I switched it up a little bit with this one but I have the Strixon ZX utility and it is an 18 degree two iron and I am hitting the Fujikura Ventus shaft in this and also, same thing, standard golf pride grips, nothing too crazy, but this thing is an absolute rock star. I love this club. Jake actually built this for me. If you didn't see that video, be sure and go watch it. But that is my two iron that is gonna be in the bag for sure all year. All right, guys, moving on to my three wood. I have the Callaway Maverick, um, and this is 13.5 degrees, pretty standard, but I'm also hitting the Fujikura Ventus 7S shaft in this club with, uh, 
this one has a cowl grip. I actually need to get this replaced because it's getting pretty pretty rusty. But um, that is my three wood. I love this club. It just very low spin. I hit it just a lot when I'm when I'm kind of it's a fairway finder, kind of like my two iron, but it just goes a little bit farther. Last but not least, uh, the club that everybody loves the most, um, including me. I love driver, but I am hitting the TaylorMade Sim 2. I just switched over to this about probably a couple months ago. I can't remember exactly when it was, but guys, and in my driver, I am hitting the Tensai Black 1K series, and this is a 60 gram shaft, and it is a tour stiff. So it is a very stiff shaft, and same thing, standard golf pride grip with no extra tape, just a standard grip. And I'm getting a lot more comfortable with this club, which is really cool because for a little while I was kind of struggling, but I'm feeling a lot better with it, so I'm excited to see kind of what happens in the future with it, with my driver. But All right, guys, so that wraps it up for the clubs. And I, I just went through, you guys know exactly what I'm hitting, exactly what clubs I'm hitting, wedges, irons, three wood driver, two iron putter, and that's that. So now we're going to move on to another segment of this video. I'm going to hit each one of those clubs, and on the screen, right over here or here, the yardage for that club, the stock yardage for that club is going to pop up and it's going to stay there for the rest of the video. So sit back, enjoy. You're probably just going to be, Trace is going to put some nice tunes in here. And uh, let's just work through this bucket of balls and see if we can hit some good shots here with, uh, with all my clubs. So it's good to be back out here hitting some balls at the one and only Frisco Lakes. All right guys, so now there's a bit of a jump from my four iron to my two iron, but this is off the tee. This is kind of like a, it's not a, it's not a club that I really used to hit into greens, but my two iron is about, it's roughly about 265 to 270. All right, guys, that is the remnants. Um, I just made my way through my bag. I actually haven't done this in a while, but that is what I'm working with. So you guys got the full picture. Those are all my clubs, my putter, and I actually had to take this out. This is my 15th club, and it is my three iron. So I haven't decided exactly. I haven't decided exactly what I'm gonna do or if I'm gonna take a club out to uh, replace that three iron, but I mean, put it in place of the three iron, but. That is my bag. That is gonna wrap up today's video. Hope you guys enjoyed this little what's in the bag. And uh, that kind of just gets it all out the open. No more questions. Um, but let me know what you have in your bag for this year. And uh, I would love to hear. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I will be seeing you real soon in some more content coming right up. And I hope you guys just have a fantastic day, whatever you're doing. And uh, I love you guys. So I'll see you guys on Saturday. Peace.